so this has kind of been the hot topic, right? So I was actually in the middle of doing a video and uh, in the middle of that video, I got a comment on um, on a past video and then I uh, YouTubed what people were talking about, uh, went to this website to see if there was any news about what people were talking about. And I guess that, um, I guess BTC Clock um, as well as some other news that was released. Um, this news and some other news uh, actually started a widespread panic uh, in a sense. So uh, what do I mean by panic? So when I say widespread panic, I mean this, right? So Bitcoin is down about $300. Ether is down 33 as well as Litecoin being down about 5 Okay, so right now, all of the, most of them, not all of them, because uh, there are a few, um, it doesn't really matter if I show you my pen, but there are a few that are not down, right? So like I mentioned, that one's down. Uh, there are a few like Ripple who are down as well, 12%. We then have Dash who's not down, right? Oh, Dash is down 1% now. Okay, so it wasn't down earlier, but it is down now, right? So you see Dash was trending up. Uh, Nim was uh, up for a little bit. It's now down, going down. And, um, oops, I meant to go back, sorry. I don't even know if you guys can even see me typing my password. That's actually kind of cool. Um, as well as uh, Ether, Ethereum uh, Classic. So most of these were not down, right? So what happened was, uh, in a second you're going to see like a notification pop up because um, it's 5 o'clock. But basically what's happened is uh blockchain or sorry btc clock uh, has gone bust um we knew that it would be a matter of time um i do apologize i had just done a video um and in my video if you notice my video is pretty much saying that it'll be a while before they go bust and as you guys can see i try to withdraw everything but they're going bust so i'll turn it sideways this morning, I withdrew this because it wouldn't let me press the reinvest button. Uh, what I was going to do is I was going to reinvest it. I think that stops my videos. Nope, it didn't. I was going to do was I was going to withdraw it and then reinvest it tomorrow or the following day, giving the fact that it wouldn't let me press the button. And as you guys can see, I got that 0 0.013. And that was the last time they were paying out. Um, they released something on their um, Telegram. They released on that app. I don't have the link. I was gonna try. I'll try to find it. Hopefully, if I find it, it'll be in the description. Um, they released an article indicating that they are no longer paying out. So um, yeah. So instead of saying you know withdraw your deposit, uh, <laughs> what they're pretty much saying is they're no longer paying out. Uh, thanks to uh, Sedgwick and um, I think that's how you say it. Sedgwick and um, Segwit, I don't know. Anyway, Sedwick, uh, two two X, and then the other one. Uh, thanks to them and that uh, you know that information there. Thanks to all of that, we're pretty much gonna get screwed out of our bitcoins. So, yeah. So there. So pretty much that's it. You know, um, we pretty much lost money. Now, the reason why I'm addressing this now, finally after like five hours of already knowing the information. Right, it's actually not five hours. It's about three hours. Is because I actually been in my chat all day trying to try to figure out things. Um, um, because we're in, I'm in a bunch of different sites, as you guys know. Um, I did do a big withdrawal, but um, you guys don't really know what those funds are for. Uh, those funds normally do fund me p doing these websites, um, but those funds also have their own purpose. Uh, that have nothing to do with uh, my YouTube website. And uh, some of those funds, um, most of them, I should say, uh, have a purpose. And since they have to go to that purpose, I can no longer say that I'm going to keep my money in some of these sites. Okay, so what is my plan and how can and what is your plan? So there's two things that I wanted to say, right? One, Trady.io, I feel like could go bust. Um, at any moment it kind of sucks but i have to kind of put that out there because of the fact that 
they are on kind of the same grid as the rest of the world, right? I'm going to withdraw from them pretty much every day. I'm going to try to withdraw every day as often as I can uh, until the day they go bust. Now, I'm going to just say this right now. Uh, as far as the contest goes, I usually don't talk about the contest, but, you know, I, I think someone commented about it. Uh, I'll just show you guys where I'm at. I'm not going to win. I'm not going to even get half a Bitcoin. And if I got half a Bitcoin, this is where I'm at now. I'm pretty much going to tell my people to stop. Stop investing, right? So this is where I'm going to end at 0 .0, 0 0.6. So I did the math. I would probably have to end up with about three Bitcoins by the end of the program. I'll show you guys that at the end of the program where I would have to end up at to, for me to actually get paid out a half a Bitcoin. What I was hoping was once I get paid out a half a Bitcoin, I will help you guys out. Um, but I don't think it's going to happen. Right. Um, I think that what's going to happen is they're not going to pay out their 25 um, and everyone that didn't make their 20, that didn't make their 100 percent back or their 200 percent or whatever it is. They're just going to get screwed out of their Bitcoins. I feel bad because I kind of feel like I put people in that predicament to actually get screwed over. Um, most people won't give you that type of honesty, but I will. Um, Crypto Daily, we already know um, they're going to not pay out anymore. Uh, we're going to probably end up getting. Um, screwed on crypto daily uh i'm, I'm just going to do a quick withdrawal because i want to see if i have something uh coming back to me or if it all is going to say pending i'm pretty much going to just do like a little run through of everything that i went through uh just in, in my head right so i guess they're still paying out so if anybody still has money in there i guess it's still paying out this one it's only paying out two percent a day so i don't have to worry about that one giving me anything uh this one i may actually withdraw the 0 0.01 i'm going to lose about seven percent on a 0 0.01 um, but until I see like you know s until the first happens I think that once once the first hits I have that ability to now start playing the market again but as of right now I just I don't know man I, I just don't trust it and I just can't tell you guys to trust it if I personally don't trust it so I'm probably gonna withdraw once it says 0 0.0105 right I'm 0 0.05 here I'm gonna probably withdraw the top amount and just let it sit and let it sit forever and just see what happens right uh where are we at F fex fund um my seven days are almost up oh my seven days are almost up i'm not going to reinvest it i'm not going to test it out anymore i don't advise anyone else to test it out i don't have any referrals if anybody's wondering did you get any referrals don't have any referrals zero direct referrals and direct referrals as well if there's any uh, laser.online this is the one that I kind of feel like personally may not go bust uh, this one's a little bit different than the rest of them um, they do things a little bit differently but their money is just strictly dollars they're not actually in bitcoins so I think it might actually last a little bit um, but if I say a little bit I mean like maybe August 14th or so but it all is on dependent of bitcoins not being like really crappy so uh, if you put in an amount it's going to suck because whatever you put in Bitcoin wise is going to come out money wise. And it's going to be worth a lot less. So as of right now, uh, I would say kind of stay away because unless you were going to put in using actual advanced cash. Right. So if you're going to use cash, you might be good. But when it comes to actually investing your Bitcoins, it's going to suck because your twenty five dollar Bitcoin investment is going to be worth like eight dollars. You know, it's going to be worth actually no, because it's actually converting it. So it actually might be a better idea to invest your Bitcoins into this as well uh, if it doesn't go bust because they convert everything into dollars. So it's a little bit different. So I actually like this one um, potentially actually saving us uh, a little bit of money. Um, this one right here did the same thing. Um, but since Ether and like I told you guys, if you feel like Bitcoins are going to go down, invest, blah, 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 blah. So we'll press the withdraw button. We'll press withdraw all three. And then, as you guys can see, I cleared my balance. This one, I got to wait till it's $10. Um, I thought it was 5 but I guess it's 10 So, we have to wait on that one. Uh, 0 0.005. I'm pressing the withdraw button. It's not letting me withdraw. So, whatever. Uh, and then we also got, I think that was it. That was it, right? Yeah, I think that was it. Oh, and then this one, uh, I'm kind of stuck in it. This is the one that I was doing the video on. You guys will probably end up not seeing the part where the thing popped up because it happened right at the end, right when I was going to say goodbye. But actually, I was actually, I was actually just rambling. So, 
yeah, man, that's that's pretty much it. If anybody has any questions, let me know. Um, I hope I didn't cause anyone to lose any money. I, that's not my intention. Is not to make to get rich off of anyone. Um, as you guys saw, I was in with you guys. As you guys saw, I also even put in my BTC clock um, underneath the um, uh, in my description when I was talking to you guys. Uh, the one thing that I, I made very, very apparently known, the one thing I made known was that if I want you guys to put your money in, I'm going to definitely put my money in as well. Um, if I want you guys to trust it, I want to trust it as well. I'm not going to tell you to do something that I, don't, I wouldn't do myself. So I kind of feel like as my, I would consider you guys my villagers, um, as the people that follow me, um, my subscribers, the one thing that I want to say is that you know my intention is to never cause something like this to happen where you feel man i just put my money in and i just got scammed you know and you know and you're pretty much blaming me I, I would blame me too i'm just being honest with you i would too i'm i'm in a predicament where there's about 300 dollars potentially you know just sitting there in my account saying withdraw me and i can't even withdraw it so um we're kind of all in the same boat i wish that there was a way that i could withdraw this money um even the smallest amount 0 0.0005 can't even be withdrawn at this current moment. So um, I wish I knew this. I would have withdrawn it and, you know, maybe would have told everybody, get your money out ASAP. But, you know, I didn't predict it. So I, I, I couldn't tell anybody else to predict it. Anybody else that's invested already, please, you know, please stop reinvesting because I've noticed um, uh, my withdrawal amount keeps going up. And that means that people are investing still. So I just wanted to put this out there before too many people reinvest or keep on investing. Um, the reason why I actually started the video, uh, actually started the panic was because of the reinvest wasn't working. So I didn't panic, panic, but I withdrew because of that. So, and I'm surprised I even paid out a little bit. So if anyone has any questions, put it down in the comment, join our group. Uh, we are talking a lot in there. So we're trying to figure out some things. We're trying to figure out maybe we can hold off or what's the best strategy. We are strategizing in there. So there's a few people that have a few ideas um, that might be helpful. Um, even for those who have like the smallest amount. Um, and you know, if you guys have lost anything, my email will be down at the bottom. Uh, if you guys want to send me what you what you have pending in here, we'll try to figure out a way maybe to help everyone out. If there's a way that I can do it, you know, I'll try. This is 95 people, you know what I mean? Um, and some of you guys have like five or six Bitcoins in here. I, I can already tell, you know what I mean? There's stuff like that, that I probably can't get back. But if Bitcoin drops enough, which we're hoping it does on August 1st, if it drops enough, you never know. Um, we might be able to do something dangerous, you know what I mean? Where, you know, buying 10 to 100 Bitcoins, you know what I mean, would, would be perfect. Now, I'm not saying that I'm looking to, you know, um, um, replenish anyone that has lost any Bitcoins. Um, I'm not saying that my intention is to do that, but my intention is not to have you guys lose any money. So if there's something that I can do personally, to help you guys get that back. What I'm saying is my email will be down at the bottom. You can let me know what you lost and then we can try to figure some things out. I'm not making any guarantees. I'm not telling you I'm gonna pay you back. I didn't lose your money. You know, again, I told people to put in only what they're willing to lose. So that's the number one thing is that only put in what you're willing to lose. And if you're a type of person that's not willing to lose, as you saw, my amount just went back up again. Um, if you're not a type of person that's willing to, that doesn't have, that doesn't have anything to lose. Like if you have, if you can't lose it, if that $18 or that $180 or that $1,800 is a lot of money, obviously you don't invest it. But if it's like, you know what, I'm not doing anything with it anyway, that's what you want to invest. So um, I'm going to post this video from this point. Um, I know I know a lot of people made it to this end, but I wanted to just show you guys what happened uh, literally a day late to the party. Um, I withdrew a lot of it and I kind of sucks that I withdrew so much yesterday and um, I'm glad I didn't reinvest it you know could have really got hurt um, but yeah uh, just want to put that out there if anybody has any questions suggestions we have a group going look in my description click on the telegram group and uh, you know let's start strategizing let's try to figure out our next strategy our next options because uh, a lot of these sites are gonna go bust in about a week literally a week so alright guys uh, withdraw your money Hopefully BTC clock doesn't go bust and they give us all our money back.